Alrighty, this is a video for all my AMC apes out there. I just want to give you some facts. Hopefully you can look at this and see what I see and just realize where the best investment's supposed to be, where you should be. Um, this is a Fintel tracker, which basically tracks all the dollar values held by retail. And so it says that 3.89% of all retail investments is in AMC right now. And then we got a little leaderboard right here of the top nine companies. Now, it suggested that 63% of AMC is owned by retail, but I'm going to prove to you that it's less than 63%, or less than 63%. So if we look at the AMC market cap, um, AMC market cap is $8.76 billion. So if we take $8.76 billion and we divide that, or sorry, we times that by 63%, we get $5.51 billion. This is suggesting if you take the insiders and subtract that from the outstanding shares, um, and then you calculate that into the market cap, it's suggesting AMC owns $5.51 billion. Um, but it says that Mullen is one sixth of this investment. So if I divide this by six, that suggests that Mullen has $919 million of retail money invested. But the problem with that is if I divide that by the $1.3 um, per share that Mullen's at right now, that says there's only, that says that retail owns 700 million shares of Mullen. Now, Mullen can never be more than 580 million shares. And so what that means is, is that AMC owns less than 63% of AM or sorry, retail owns less than 63% of AMC. So if we go back to that $8.75 billion, I believe it was, yep, $8.75 billion. And we assume that retail owns, let's say 40% of that, that'd be $3.5 billion. Mullen is one sixth of that. That'd be $583 million. Divide that by 1.3. That'd be 448 million shares that Mullen owns right now, and it can never be more than 580 million. So, I mean, I'm just lowballing the crap out of AMC saying retail only owns 40% of it. And if that is true, then that means retail owns 448 million shares in Mullen, and there can never be more than 580 million. So, there's only 130 million shares left. So, I can't guarantee that this is accurate about Mullen. I mean, they could have 300 million shares and AMC could only be owned 25% by retail. But this is mathematical proof based off the Fintel, subtracting insiders, all that good stuff, and then comparing the Fintel percent ownership. So if we look at this, it says Mullen's 0.64% and AMC's 3.89%. That's a six times difference. And so if you trust this Fintel number right here, you can't be invested in AMC. Like, this is the proof that AMC is no longer owned by retail and you're just letting your money burn. Where Mullen, no matter how you chalk it up with this AMC number, it's proof that Mullen is owned a majority by retail because the market cap is so small. 0.64% of retail owning it is a huge amount of shares and it has to squeeze to guarantee people sell your AMC by Mullen.